All right, I want to show you how to use Ambit Update. Now, Ambit Update obviously is a pretty um, easy to use piece of software, and it's designed to work with your current skills, um, your current computer skills. So it's made for non-technical people to allow you to just jump in and make quick and easy changes to your site. So I'm going to give you a quick little walkthrough of how to use it so you can kind of start to pull back on how much you uh, rely on your webmaster. When, it, when you need changes, you can get them done. So once you have Ambit Update, you have access to this button, which once it's installed, you just go to a page on your website. And this is just a sample uh, website I threw together to demonstrate stuff. Um, you just hit the Edit This Page button. So once you've chosen a page on your actual website, you just hit the Edit This Page button, and it's going to open up the Ambit Update Editor. Now, once it's open, making changes is simple. You just start uh, typing on the screen. Um, it's really that simple. Um, there's a lot of other things you can do. Um, you can bold, italic, underline, you know, all the stuff you'd expect to see in a traditional word processor. And it's designed to make you feel right at home once you jump in and start using it. So you can do pictures, videos, audio, whatever you want. You just dig through and you can find what you want in these tabs up here. So once you're done, once you've made the changes you want uh, to make, all you have to do to make it live for the world to see is hit this publish button. Now if you're not ready for the world to see your wonderful changes, you just hit the save button and it'll just, you know, store a local snapshot of your site. But once you hit publish, the changes that you've made are going to go live for the entire world to see just like that. You don't have to wait for a webmaster or anything like that to see your changes go live. So there it is, right there, live. All right, so now let's go ahead and change one of the pictures um, on the site, just to kind of show off a couple of the other features. So let's change this. This is a kind of a boilerplate picture of a map. Um, let's change that to um, an image of, a, um, uh, of some paint buckets. So again, all you do is you just hit the Edit This Page button. Um, and then you're taken inside. It's open. And now we can just jump to the image, press delete, and hit this picture button. Then I'm going to just navigate to my pictures folder. And here's a nice little picture. I just hit open. And then it sends it over and it puts it right where I want it. It's really, really that simple. And again, when I want to make some changes, oh, and just to show you, you can do, put a video here, audio. Um, if you want to hyperlink it somewhere else, you can do that right there. There's really, really whatever you want. There's, there's something there. Um, when you're ready for it to go live, I told you already. You just hit publish, and let's go ahead and view the live page. And there it is. Really, really simple. That was not very hard <laughs> to do. You just get in and you make your changes, and you're done. Now, obviously, if you ever get stuck or you have any questions, um, there's a professional webmaster that can help you right there live as if they were in the same room with you right here behind this, uh, behind this button. So it's really simple. Now, if you don't have uh, Ambit Update yet, just head over to ambitupdate.com forward slash try it now. You just type in your website, hit this button, and you're in. You can start making the changes um, to your website anytime you want. Now, once it knows how to talk to your website, um, then you can publish them, publish the changes live to your website anytime you need them. All right. So that was Ambit update.